there, friends. How's it going? I want to show you the best zombie game you may or may not have seen already. It's called Project Zomboid, and it's not much to look at at first glance, but it is so good. The last time we played, we played as the man, and we were going to do a life from start to finish. Then I died immediately, so we restarted as the man. Two. We found a quaint little spot in the city, got some basic supplies, and somehow survived what seemed like an impossible situation to get out of. I stood on some glass in my bare feet and I was bleeding out. <laughs> Yet another episode of Kevin Does Dumb Stuff. Zombie edition. So this is the man too. This is where I keep my stuff <laughs> Including a loaded pistol on the ground. Uh, this is my old vehicle. It's kind of smashed up I killed a lot of zombies with this. It's currently just a little tunnel You have to go through to get into my house and <laughs> these are all the zombies it killed I want to repair my machete, but for that I think I'm gonna need duct tape or adhesive tape So I might swing by like a hardware store or something that seems like a good idea and honestly I could use more defenses so building things would be a good idea in general. Perhaps I could even build a friend. Like it's so lonely here other than these corpses. <laughs> I forgot I had broken into the side apartments here as well. <laughs> okay, so this is where I live above the pawn store and honestly, I need to get in here. There might be something good. It might be worth disassembling this door and taking a look. There's a bar here which I need to raid. I want loads of bourbon for Molotov cocktails <laughs> and then the hardware store just up the street. So I'm in a pretty good neighborhood. Oh, look at this fun extreme mini golf bowling arcade and laser tag. I should go there. <laughs> <sighs> I got bitten, scavenging for laser guns. It was worth it. Okay, morning is here. We're heading out into the open world. My clothes look a little worse for wear as well. Maybe I should look for replacements or, you know, wash them once. Oh, now we're talking. We got some new camo shorts here. Sorry, you probably can't see me now. Like not due to the camo pants, just the lights are off. Let me turn them on. There, all better. And a new leather jacket. There we go, I'm stylish again. Can't really make out the writing on my, my vest. You might think it said police, but it actually says pro-lice. I'm very pro-lice. Oh, carpentry books. Okay, now we're sorted. Oh, a shotgun. I'm gonna attach that to my back. This pawn store is actually very rewarding. And the thing is, I must have already been in here because there's a few dead zombies around. Oh my God, a pickaxe. <laughs> All right, now we're Minecrafting. Let's get going. Now, I don't know about you, but I always want my clothing to be pretty cool. So I'll keep my old clothing in the freezer along with my raw chicken and ice cream. Oh, wait, hold on. I've been reading a book. I'm like a hundred pages in and he just keeps saying, I already know that, but he doesn't have free will. So I got to read this other book. Okay. I'm just going to take the book with me because it's taking way too long to read. Let's get going. I got a belly full of jelly beans and I'm ready to fight zombies. Wait a second. There's a zombie coming at me from, oh, all right, well, the van doesn't work at all. <laughs> Just so we're all on the same page here. It's absolutely useless. Well, the bar is completely empty, like of zombies. I found some bourbon, so I'm pretty happy with that. Some Molotovs or disinfectant, whatever I choose, you know? Who knows where the night might lead us? I might go on a homicidal rampage or I might be dying of death. Honestly, both are equally possible, I feel. I'm gonna make a Molotov cocktail just to be, sh just to be safe, you know? <laughs> okay, I have it ready and I, I have my lighter. <laughs> Just in case things get dicey. Okay, we got some zombies over here. Quite a few. Many more than one, and that's how many there are of me, so I'm outnumbered. <laughs> Just in case you didn't understand the situation. Honestly though, with my many years of Minecrafting, this is going pretty well. I pick you to die next. Oh, oh, oh. oh wait, there's many more. Hold on, I'm just a miner, go easy on me. Damn, this is strong. What is even in here? What attracted you all in? Oh, just a reasonable rental for a little business, I guess. All right, here we are. Zach's Hardware. Hey, everyone. <laughs> I'm just looking for some tape. No one has to die here today. There we go. I lied. You're technically already dead, though, so I, I'm kind of telling the truth. Like, surely you can't die twice. Come on, you gotta have some tape. What kind of a hardware store doesn't have tape? Oh, tape! Excellent. Honestly, I got this to, like, repair my machete, and it'll be good for a backup, but I'm using the pickaxe from now on. It's so good. Okay, I could only find one tape, unfortunately. I got some other stuff that might be a bit useful. Um, I also see these flashlight things, the floodlights that 
could come in handy. I might come back here at some point for them. Oh, welder mask. Wait, how is that less strong than whatever I'm wearing? Right now I just have a beard on. All right, well, I'll wear the safety goggles then to protect me from myself. Now I look hardcore. I got the dust mask, the safety goggles, the full camo. I look like me when the pandemic first broke out and no one knew what was happening. I was wearing a full-on ghillie suit and that was just to work from home. Okay, my guy is not doing so well. He's panicking. He's thirsty. <laughs> he's too warm. He's wet. He's panicking. He's accessorizing. I'm wearing the zombie's earrings. <laughs> oh, there is far too many people at the laser tag. I was joking earlier, but I would actually die for it, so it's probably not worth it. I'd like to try and find a vehicle or something. What the hell? Uh, how did I end up in the building? <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Ah! Oh. Sorry, it was your fashion sense that disgusted me in actuality. You didn't scare me. Nothing can scare me. Ah! Scary! Oh man, these houses look so cool too. They look way better than mine. Maybe I should look at moving. My place is pretty vulnerable as is. But I'd like a bit of a garden too. Like, I guess I need to get my house in order first and get a vehicle before I look at actually moving to a better spot. And who knows, maybe this will be like fixable. There are gardens at the back I could break into. So there's a building pretty close that has an underground car park. I I might take a look at that. If not, we got plenty of other car parks around, but I may as well take a look close to home first. No, oh, the garage is open. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. It's a bad thing, I'm leaving. That means I've already been here, I guess. Wait. My taxi's still fine. I thought my taxi was ruined. <laughs> All right, well, that saves a lot of time. I'm gonna do a food run, fill up the tank, and do a little bit of a meds run if I can find a nearby pharmacy or something. Oh, wait, no, my taxi's not fine. <laughs> it's just conking out on me. Okay, yeah, that's why I didn't want to use it. Let me uh, try to find another vehicle on my journey then. Oh shit, oh no, 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 keep going. Just a little head trauma, it's just a little head trauma. Oh God, it's gone again. Okay, I can, I can take these on foot. This is, yeah, this is fine. <laughs> Are we good? Okay, I think we're good. Now, uh, we're not good. <laughs> There's one single straggler, but other than that, I think we're good. Oh no, where did all you come from? <laughs> the game really wants me to be a liar today, doesn't it? Ooh. A key? And it has even a little bit of fuel in it. Let's take a little look to see how this bad boy is doing. Okay, we got a lot of green and orange, and that's about as far as my mechanic knowledge will take me. So <laughs> I think it's okay. Like, we got a few smashed windows, which isn't ideal in a zombie apocalypse. Okay, we're moving out. We got to get to a gas station, though. Actually, maybe I still have gas in the taxi that I can take? I still have my fuel tank. I just attracted loads of zombies. That's all I've done. <laughs> oh, this other taxi has gas as well. I was like, oh, I'll take out the, the gas from my taxi and then I realized that's not even my taxi. <laughs> I'm just gonna check to make sure the driver's window is okay. <laughs> that's kind of important, I guess. Yeah, it is. It's hanging in there. And now I can add gasoline. This thing is entirely full between the two taxis. Wash vehicle. <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> All right, well, we're abandoning it, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Oh, God damn it! <laughs> There's only one thing in that entire area and I smacked into it. Oh no, that's really hurt the car. <laughs> that was actually very dangerous. That could have killed me. I, a real panic was about to ensue there for a second. I can't believe I've done this. <laughs> Oh, I've done it again. It's not on purpose even, I swear. <laughs> At least that wasn't as hard as the first time. It's because I'm usually a Sunday driver, but I'm apparently not on this character. So I'm just <laughs> flying down the road in danger all the time. Well, I'm too stubborn to get another car again, so we'll just have to deal with this for now. Oh my God. Oh God, that's a lot of zombies. Just a Sunday drive. I may not be a Sunday driver, but I still appreciate just a relaxing drive, knocking down tens and tens of zombies. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, we're done. I'm done with this car. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh, there's many. Well, terrible news, everyone. My car is now stuck. I have no gas, and every car here is burnt out. There are also hordes of zombies coming to kill me. <laughs> No one can stop me and my diamond pickaxe. Luckily, there seems to be a few cars in here in this car park. Oh God, where did all you come from? <laughs> Doesn't matter, I'm Minecrafting. There we go. <laughs> this is ridiculous how many he's killed. He's up to 225 zombies killed in five days. This man 
Well, the man too is going to completely solve the zombie apocalypse as soon as he can figure out how to drive. <laughs> okay, I'm soaking and I'm getting dehydrated. I need uh, liquid fast. Why can't I just drink my own sweat? Come on, be a problem solver. Think outside the box. Or wait, actually, just think like entirely within the box. I have water on me. <laughs> I brought it with me for this exact reason. I get very thirsty. There's a queue of people getting into whatever that business is. <laughs> I've never seen the zombie zombies queue before but to be fair it looks like a nice diner oh i think i found a car that actually works and by that i mean something that's functional but has no fuel whatsoever go away it's my car i spotted it first okay you can have it actually i don't want it <laughs> I think that Jeep just started. This man just killed like 20 zombies. Here, there's another one for you <laughs> just to get this Jeep. Oh my God, they don't stop coming. They really want this Jeep. Where are you all coming from? <laughs> I can't believe this pickaxe that I picked up on a whim is like fundamental to my survival at this point. <laughs> oh, this one's back in heat. Take him down. <laughs> okay, let's see. Is it working? It is working. Okay, awesome. And this is so, so much cooler than my previous vehicle. Like, this is awesome. I'm glad things played out this way. I'm gonna start beeping and drag them away from where my car is so hopefully i can go back and get the fuel because that's one thing this isn't doing too great on okay i think i actually made the situation worse there is uh, many more on the car than i had hoped uh oh uh oh okay this is quickly getting a little bit overwhelming and now they're around my truck as well why would i do this to myself hey over here hey now i just gotta find like a back way in through here and i think i came out one of these doors this one right yeah do you not have like a staff room with a sink hell i'll even take a toilet at this rate i need something to drink oh my god look at them all gathered around my car okay i'm gonna make a run for the car and just try and drive out of here go 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 go, go. oh why did i do this oh, okay it's working it's working follow me <laughs> i'm just praying i make it at this point i've forgotten all about that other car i'm not going back it's too far away i just need to get back into town if i can a <laughs> uh, like-minded individual was driving here <laughs> God, I almost clung a lamppost. I would have probably just died at this speed. The medical center, here it is. Okay, I don't know if this is a good idea, but I'd like to stop and get some supplies. I smashed into a wall. Okay, maybe maybe I should I should park a bit more tactfully rather than just pull up to the front door. I'll try and pull them away again. And it's actually right down the street from my house, which is now infested with zombies. I'm gonna start storing my vehicles in here. It only makes sense if you ask me. There we go. All I gotta do is find some cars with some gas and siphon the fuel. Oh, this zombie had antidepressants and a walkie-talkie. Okay, just what I needed. The antidepressants, you know, for obvious reasons, and the walkie-talkie so it looks like I'm not talking to myself all the time. I can drop off some of my stuff and get a drink here at least. We're up to 264 zombies killed. <laughs> now I'm gonna try and get as much medical gear as I can. I'm doing okay on food. I'll treat myself to an onion. Oh, lucky the man too. I could use some shotgun shells too, but I don't even know where to go for that. First stop though, the gas station. That's important. I hope I can make it. I love this car. I, I don't want to have to <laughs> separate from it and I, I'll, I'll take care of it this time, I promise. Oh my god i think i actually made it no this isn't the place but it's next door and i think i'll make it it's right on the e but i think i've made it can you get out of the way i'm trying to back up over here sorry road rage <laughs> refuel from gas pump yes wow this is taking a long time i hope nothing sneaks up on me i just love filling up my tank at 2 a.m in the morning okay i'm actually getting nervous i have to check no, no i think i'm okay yeah i'll just do a proper inspection i'm all right i think i should also be looking for garbage bags because at this point i should should be looking to get like rain collectors out because eventually the water will get turned off and you know what my guys like with water like we just drove here and my guy's already thirsty whoa this thing holds a lot of fuel this took a long time to fill up he's been standing out here for nearly an hour just filling his car oh the car even came with a shovel and a first aid case now not only do i have a kit that'll help me if i get any boo-boos but i can bury it so that no one else can find it. I got myself like a fistful of candy as well. Well, actually, no, it's a whole bag full of candy. I also found some bleach, uh, dish towels, and a fire extinguisher, which is great because A, I really need to clean, and B, fire is never too far in my distant future. So now, since I have this awesome truck, I'm just gonna put everything from, well, actually, no, one second. I'm gonna throw these on the ground because I love littering, and then I'm gonna put everything else into the back of the truck, even my cereal. 
mail that I've been carrying around with me. It's still closed. There's still like a, a toy in it or something. In fact, I think I'll open it now. I need the, the serotonin boost. I'm also going to eat the entire box of cereal at 4 a.m. in the middle of the car park. Yes, I got a dance card out of it. Okay, put that in the trunk. That's my prized possession. <laughs> Let's take a look at this thing. How actually is it doing? Pretty good, actually. This is a pretty nice car. I love it. Oh, I really hope nothing bad happens to it. Oh, it even has a box of shotgun shells in it. This is the best car ever. And cigarettes, a lighter. You got tactical walkie-talkies and alcohol wipes. God, I've spent so long getting excited over that. I gotta go get a drink again. I was gonna say I can pull in here where there are no zombies and lay low and sneak into the medical building, but there's plenty of zombies here. <laughs> okay, put away my gas can and we're just gonna jump this fence. We're gonna be a bit cheeky. Okay, they're coming around. They're also being a bit cheeky. Oh, this, this place is locked up good wherever this building is. Oh, the doors are locked. Can I do anything to this? Can I disassemble the door? Uh, it's a metal door. Oh man, there's no way around this. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do the old Uno reverse card on them and I'm gonna go back to where I originally was. And now they have to filter all the way around again and I can pick them off one by one. That was a mercy killing. <laughs> That's the sound I make when I try and stand up off the ground. <laughs> and I know the pain that caused you. Okay, I'm committing to a pretty big fight here, but this is all in the name of medical security. And I really hope that nothing comes up behind me because I will get really stuck. Oh no, man, I'm kind of regretting my decision. This may not have been the best idea. Oh, it's thinning out. I'm just terrified something will come behind me. Absolutely terrified. <laughs> no. I think we're okay. I, I got them all earlier. Phew. No, my pickaxe just broke. Oh God. Oh no. Oh no, there's one in the window. Okay, I, I got my hammer. I'm ready. Ah, ah, my leggies. I mean, ah, my lower limbs, which are very strong and manly. Look at all the blood. <laughs> Luckily, none of it is mine, at least yet. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, now it's like some sort of clown car. How many of them are there? Oh, it's like Smash Mouth said, they don't stop coming. Except for this one. He was just never all there to begin with. He's slamming into that door. I need water. <laughs> but what else is new? Oh my god. They're all lining up for the buffet. <laughs> this is not good. I really can't take on a big horde with just a hammer. I really gotta pray the ones across the street don't hear this. Luckily, the hammer fight has actually gone pretty well. So far, at least. You just gotta be really careful and try to, like, stand on the ones that are already dying on the ground. Yes, water. <laughs> he can be relatively happy as long as he has water. You can tell I've already been here before from the dead bodies and the uh, ketchup and dance magazine on the floor. <laughs> That's traces of Kevin if I've ever seen him. Oh, I'm getting very tired of fighting all these zombies though. <laughs> okay, jackpot. Yes, this will protect future Kevin for whatever accident he inevitably gets himself in. Last time I was here, I, I was just in danger of losing my life because I ran on a load of broken glass. <laughs> I know when you heard the first half of that sentence, you were probably like, oh, zombie the apocalypse. I wonder what happened, but no, I, I just barefoot ran on loads of glass. I almost died, but uh, I managed to get just enough to keep me hanging in there. And look at him now, stronger than ever. Okay, I think we are okay. I got everything I need. My inventory is completely full. I'm pretty sure I could last an entire year in the apocalypse with the amount of medical supplies I just got. Look at all these. Oh, yeah, that's my trail, all right. <laughs> There's not enough bleach in the world to clean up this mess. What kills are we up to? 305! We cracked the big 300! I'm thirsty again and I just left the hospital. I'm heading home. Oh no! My Jeep! Oh no, everything's fine. I'm not gonna learn from this because there was no consequences to my actions. Home, yay. Oh man, <laughs> what are you guys doing? Why are there so many hanging out at my house now? Even with just a hammer, he's quite the force to be reckoned with. Will you stop following me on the ground? How are you keeping up to me down there? The man too is not simply the man too. He is man and machine too. I feel like I'm getting a little bit cocky and it's actually gonna get me killed. So I have to be a bit more careful. <laughs> like the past, I don't know, minute, minute and a half has just proven that I'm vulnerable to dying at any point 
point between all these zombies nearly getting me and rolling my vehicle in the middle of the street. The odds are unlikely that I would have made it this far at all. Who needs competence when you have this many medical supplies though? Like I'm gonna be fine. Okay, I'm gonna need a source of wood so that I can make some sort of rain collectors and maybe a little wall here somewhere just so I feel a little bit more secure. I guess for wood, I could just start going into their houses and destroying stuff, right? <laughs> like there are no trees around. Oh wait, there is actually, that might be easier. <laughs> Let me get an ax. Okay, so I've done a little bit of work. A lot of zombies died for this. I've built a wall here. The fence is talking. That's a little upgrade I did. I just don't know how I did it. Uh, oh, I've not finished this, but look, you can watch me in action. Yeah, walling myself in. <laughs> cool. Okay, that's the wall done. We're gonna take my sledgehammer and we're gonna destroy this part of the fence. There we go. And look, I've made this. <laughs> it's a little garden so we can put down some crops. There we go. Look at this. Now we can make a rain catcher. I'm gonna have to repair this pickaxe. I need it back. So I need some glue or tape, one or the other. But we'll put it away for now. <laughs> oh wait, can I not? <laughs> but it's so heavy. Oh, it's because it's a favorite item. I don't even know how I did that. Oh, I stored it in the oven. Okay. <laughs> oh, I think I left the garbage bags inside the truck. <laughs> I forgot I still had like a whole truckload of cargo. Wait a second. I didn't. Oh, I did leave the garbage bags with my candy. Okay, good. <laughs> it's all trash really when it comes down to it I suppose and it's all edible as well it's just some of it is tastier than the rest oh man I love eating trash here we go a rain collection barrel nice okay now we just need it to rain Okay, I've been standing here for hours and not a drop of rain. Plus, I'm parched, feeling faint and dizzy from the thirstiness. Why does my character have to be so damn thirsty? Okay, you know what? Maybe we can just leave that there and in the meantime, I'll go try and get some farming supplies. <laughs> Luckily, we have a shovel. The car gifted us that. Okay, it's 5 a.m. I had a smoke. I'm eating an entire box of cereal and then we're gonna head out. We're gonna get some ammunition and hopefully we're gonna get some seeds. Look at that green little icon stuffed tummy growing boy oh my god it looks like there's been a war zone on my street at least no one will be speeding through here other than me because well it's got built-in speed ramps everywhere okay i got a good lead on a hardware store down this way the one i haven't been to and then i think after that we'll stop by a little small gun store and hopefully get plenty of ammo and a few extra guns oh sorry um Oh no, it was meant to be. Oh no, it's here. <laughs> okay, good. I thought I mixed up the directions. Okay, there's not like a crazy amount of zombies here. I think I can take these. Wait, is one of them hitting my car? You better not be hitting my car. I just got this thing. Wait, no, I think, is he hitting another window somewhere else? I'm so confused where that sound is coming from. Die, again, die. Ah, oh, there's still more. Oh no, they're crowding me a little bit. Oh, this isn't looking too good actually. I don't like this at all. Is the store open? Yes, oh no. There's a guy still in here. I just came for seeds. Yes, the window's open. This is actually perfect. I'm hoping they'll just come in one by one now and I can just execute them. <laughs> I don't have strength in numbers. I gotta use my, my two brain cells instead. <laughs> This worked out perfectly, actually. This has, funnily enough, been the closest I've come to dying. I was just relatively calm about it for some reason. I'm just worried I'm getting too cocky. How are we doing? Surely that must be nearly all of them. Okay, come in. And now I'll just slowly make my way out. They're still obsessed with the windows and doors out here. So that's good for me, I guess. I don't know where this guy's going. No one even went in there. Perfect. All right, what have we got here? Oh, candy. This will make me happy. Peppermint, yummy. <laughs> Who needs a farm? I'll just live off candy like I did for the first year when I moved out by myself. <laughs> okay, all the fresh food is starting to rot now in this world, so that's not good. Oh, there's some weird glitch. I was going to eat this entire stick of butter, but it says it'll make him unhappy. I'm gonna check the storeroom for any seeds. Ah, oh, the sacks of carrots, but they're all gone. No, I think hardware store. That's my best bet. Oh, and drinking out of the toilet. I love that as well. Give me some of that. Mmm, yummy. Good bacteria. 
I think that was the world's first socially awkward zombie. He just kind of looked at me and then looked away. <laughs> okay, here we are. Now, I need some seeds, please. I mean, I won't say no to an axe. That's pretty good. Oh, I need to keep an eye out for wood glue as well. Oh my god, a machete. Why do these stores just have everything I need? I love it. Yes, carrot seeds. Exactly what we needed. And strawberries. Perfect. I really wanted carrots because they're the fastest growing as well as cabbages. <laughs> yes, and a trowel. Well, you know the old saying. Thing. When life gives you lemons, ask for more, because we always want more. Come on, give me more goodies. Where are you at, goodies? You got any goodies back here, do you? Yes, more goodies. <laughs> got a second hammer, that's not bad. And I have another plan for the garden. We're gonna take these lights. I just hope I don't break my back doing it. <laughs> okay, that really, really hurts. I'm actually slowly killing myself by holding this. And I parked my car all the way down the road <laughs> with zombies in between us. There we go. Put it in the, the trunk. Perfect. All right. I only kind of hurt myself. And I just dump everything in the back seat of the, of the truck. I love my truck. All right. Let's get home. I might save going for guns because I don't necessarily need need them right now. And I've got a lot of stuff in the car that I should get home. I was going to say I can't remember what street I was on, but I forgot. It's pretty obvious once you get here. Okay. We do have a minor problem that that thing is... Ow. <laughs> very, very heavy. So I'm going to take it and i'm gonna jump over here i've somehow folded it into my bag and we're gonna place it down over here for some light i think they're just magically powered for now while the power is still on jump back over grab all of my useless stuff or use useful stuff i mean <laughs> sorry i was thinking about myself rather than the stuff and pull nicely in for now oh and actually take the key turn off the ignition that would be good look how skilled he is with an axe now <laughs> okay so i've never actually farmed in this game so now i have to figure out how to do it i i know how to dig graves i've done that before ah dig furrow Okay, I hope this actually works by just making a line of them. Okay, I think that's already too much to maintain, so I'll leave it at that. <laughs> and now we'll just throw down loads of carrot seeds and a little bit of cabbage seeds. Okay, I gotta have some garden storage as well. So let's see here. Carpentry. Uh... On second thought, I'll just leave them on the ground here. This is my stockpile. Oh my god, I'm dying of thirst again. <laughs> He's feeling faint and dizzy. It's been like... A couple hours, man. Come on. There. Now, I gotta have a smoke, and I gotta find where that mysterious banging noise is coming from. Ah, there it is. I knew I heard something coming from over here. Oh, there's someone getting to the other side. Maybe they were long-lost lovers. But oh well, they're dead dead now. Oh, I found duct tape in the neighbor's house. Well, that was lucky. Oh, an antidepressants. Double lucky. I went to see if the machete was a one- or two-handed weapon, and it just says, slice salami. Get bacon strips. Yeah, I'm gonna slice some salami with my machete. <laughs> just to, like, come on, my to make. Now I'm just eating the salami. I'm self-sufficient, everyone. Oh, speaking of being self-sufficient, I need to water those plants. All I have is this bottle of gasoline. Here, I'll pour it on the ground. There we go. <laughs> I love that on my carpet. It covers up all the other smells. Okay, I'm gonna fill my water bottle. I don't think this is gonna do very much. I... I did one. That's it. Are you serious? And its water levels are still dry. <laughs> okay, next time I really need to get a watering can, I think. I'll keep an eye out for it in the meantime, but I want to get that ammo so I'm very secure in myself as a person. And it's not even that far, like everything else. I'm located so centrally. That's what's great about this little hideout. I'm I'm beginning to, to just settle down here now. <laughs> oh, never mind. I was about to set up, but uh, I am thirsty. So I will be right back. <laughs> I think I just bumped into that zombie. Where are you all coming from? I keep killing- Oh, was that the machete broken already? Okay, that's disappointing. Okay, that's all them dead. This must have been just nearly broken, right? There's no way they're that fragile. Oh my god, now that I've killed them, I'm thirsty again. I just drank. <laughs> Damn you, where are you coming from? <laughs> Every time I come out here, there's more of you. Oh, hello, one more, and they have a shotgun on their back. There. All right, what do we got? Oh, uh, no ammo, just the shotgun. It is loaded, though. That's going in the back of the truck. Okay, so slight problem. Uh, the gun store is here, and uh, it's a little bit surrounded. It's actually the building that there was a giant queue of them at earlier. The one thing I know about this place is around back, it's actually pretty quiet. So at least we have that going for us. This might actually be easier than it looks for once. 
What the hell was that? Oh no, there was like a random event, a gunshot. <laughs> I hope that doesn't lead them towards me and it leads them away. Why did I jinx it? Why did I say anything, you know? I think we're okay though. At least, oh no, there's still a few coming. But all things considered, it's not much. It's just one or two stragglers. And here's where the great plan comes in. Because remember, I couldn't get in here earlier. This time I brought the sledge. I'm going in one way or another. This is a kitchen. <laughs> this is not what I wanted. Where am I? Let's try this door. <laughs> okay. There's a stairway. <laughs> Not sure if this is good or bad. Seems like apartments. I should take a drink. <laughs> I'm getting used to my guy by now. And then we're gonna come in through this wall. Who knows what we're coming into? All right, we got a filing cabinet in the way. <laughs> so I'm gonna try this door. <laughs> and by that, I mean I'm gonna make a door here because this is just a wall. Oh, there's a sink. Oh, I can just walk right by that. That's handy. Okay, great. This looks like an armory of some sort. And it explains why the zombie couldn't get through the door they were breaking. Oh, now we're talking. This is all the I could use. Oh, mine's a double barrel. This is just a straight up pump action shotgun. I might take that. We'll load that up six shots and uh, throw that on my back for a rainy day. Getting loads of attachments here. Oh, and a warning sign. I can hang that around my neck. Okay, now the big question. Do I... You know what? I do. It's not even a question. I gotta know what's in there. I'm just gonna break in through the wall, quickly swap to my machete, and I'll be ready to go. Okay, now machete time. And he still hasn't noticed. He loves that door. <laughs> to be fair, he's probably been hitting on it for weeks, just stuck in here. Okay, it's mainly just ammo, a few more guns, a few attachments that I don't really need. So, oh, I have company. Oh, there's two of them. I'm doing the old one-two on them. <laughs> I've tunneled my way around. Oh my god, there's loads of them. Okay, they've done the old one-ten on me. There was one, now there's ten. Oh no, I'm backed in here. There's no way out. Okay, can I destroy this wall really quick? Really quick? No, I can't. Can I destroy this wall really quick? Come on, dude. Come on. No, 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 no. This is really bad. Okay, I'm gonna make a run for the exit and just hope that these ones don't catch me. Ah! Okay, I'm I'm in the bathroom. I'm in the bathroom. How did they all get in here? Gee. Jesus. I'm out of here. <laughs> I hate this. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, that was too close. Okay, I need you dead fast, and I need to get out of here. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Yes! Key in the ignition, and we're out of here. I have no idea how they got in there so fast, but I think I got everything I needed. Phew, that was risky. <laughs> that was the stickiest position we got ourselves into. Phew, made it. Shut the gate, hop the wall, drink from the toilet, and I sleep. Yes. And I think we'll leave him there for now. Let me know if you want to see more of his life, but in the meantime, time, check out some more of my content here, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.